Absolutely. And you're looking at it because it looks familiar. It looks like a <laughs> cast iron skillet, right? Exactly. That's kind of what it is. But this is that no hassle cast iron. This is nonstick dishwasher safe <laughs> cast iron, which yes, means you don't is. have to baby it. You can put it on the stove top in the oven and you get that great flavor like grandma used to cook with, exactly. but better, but easier. Now, I'm just gonna pull this guy out of here, and I'm telling you, this is cast iron, this is a big pan, this is the real deal. And here's the thing, guys, a couple of particulars just to get out of the way before we talk about this dishwasher safe. Yeah cleanable, wow. washable, non-stick cast iron pan. You're getting the full 12 inch size. We're not starting yet with an eight or a 10 just to get you going on it. Mm -hmm. You're getting the full size. And before I come around and join you, Tamara, this is what I want people to see. Oh my God. Because here's what it's all about. First of all, the capacity. Yeah. You know those little blue boxes we make our cornbread yeah. with? There's six of them in here. That's 30 servings. What? And one of the reasons we love cast iron is because the cooking is so even. Look at this. Oh my there isn't one square centimeter that doesn't look like the square centimeter it. Yes. And that's what it's all about, Tamara. So let me come around here yes. and talk to you a little bit about what's going on here, okay? okay. Because people are hearing nonstick cast iron. Yeah. Well, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> right. Guys, you're looking at the first one at the network, the first one we've ever done, and it's so cool. Now, let me explain what cast iron is and why it's so important to us, okay? Okay. Cast iron is a once and once only pan that's made just for you. It's made out of a cast. That means that they take um, uh, the, the, uh, the iron, they make a mold out of sand, they pour it in and then they smash it. Now here's what happened, okay? In the early 80s, we started to get all like crazy about that non-stick cookware, the ceramic, the glass. And if you look at that under a microscope, it's flat as can be. Yeah. So it's beautiful cookware, Yeah. but it doesn't have that dimension. And what do I mean by that dimension? I mean this, the dimension that we lost when we switched to that non-stick cookware, mm -hmm. because the sand that's used to make the mold of a cast iron mm -hmm. creates hills and valleys. That means that when that natural fat and sugar drips down and flashes back up, yes. that creates the caramelization. Because oh. I gotta tell you something, no restaurant in the world advertises that yes. they're gonna cook your amazing steak yeah. on copper. <laughs> They oh. say that they're gonna cook it on cast iron, and there's a reason for that. So guys, here's your perfect steak. Okay. Pick your favorite cut, okay. then you're gonna go ahead, and you're gonna take a little bit of garlic butter, put it in the pan, and again, if you do a search, and this is what I love, these pans don't come pre-seasoned because they don't have to, oh. all right? You okay. never have to season them. You okay. can wash them in the dishwasher. You can virtually cook anything in here and then clean it with a wipe, all right? Okay. And the reason is, what, we've, uh, what we did for the first time is we bonded our non-stick properties right to the cast iron. So guys, it's not a coating. There's nothing that can come off. Okay. Right? And we've triple sealed our pan top to bottom, side to side. So whether it's the bottom, the sides, the helper handle, or the attached handle, right. it's all that beautiful non-stick dishwasher safe. I'll say it again. Yeah. Dishwasher safe cast iron. I How mean, cool is that? That's what we're saying. It's cast iron without the hassle because this is the right. deal. When you when you pulled out that, that um, cornbread, <laughs> my mom has a cast iron skillet. Uh-huh. She's got some cornbread in there, Mark, that's still stuck. <laughs> I don't know how many Thanksgivings ago. I because love that's it. what happens. Or they exactly. get rusty, or you know the deal. Yep. Um, but this is not going to be that. This is a big customer pick. Read the reviews. This is a featured price. Um, at less than $40 and worth every penny and then some. All you're doing today is choosing whether you want it in the silver, which is what you see right there. Uh, we only have 100 left in silver. You can get it in that traditional black. Wow. We also have it for you in teal. And there's also a red, and we'll show you. Uh, yeah, there's the red right <laughs> we got there. colors everywhere. <laughs> Those are your choices, um, but I encourage you to get it today. Okay, you just poured just regular dry sugar in I there. poured a couple of things that cast iron pans hate the most. Sugar, milk solids, everything like that sticks to these pans. Guys, we are actually making caramel in a cast iron pan, oh guys, you gosh, don't do that, brave. right? Watch this. This is what I call parting that sea. Have a look wow. at that, you guys. Isn't that incredible? So while my steak finishes up, watch what I'm gonna do here. And this is, again, what I love about this pan. This is the reason that in our launch, on our TS back in, I think, February, yeah. people said yes to the tune of 50,000 of these. Wow. And all you have to do is read the reviews yes. to see how happy everybody's been. Because when we say nonstick, yeah. this truly is nonstick. So careful there, I'm gonna walk okay. ahead of you. Okay. So you wanna talk back about up. a pan mm -hmm. that gives you the option 
options in the diversity oh, oh, to do some yeah. different dishes. Here's something fun to try. Oh, try a caramel apple tower. Now here's what I'm gonna do. See. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna let that fall right there. Now you do have a couple of pouring spouts on either side. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take two seconds and put my apples right on top so we can keep building that throughout the day. But here's what I really need you to see. Okay. I'm gonna grab a damp cloth here and mm -hmm. have a look. Mm -hmm. When we talk about cleanup, you can't clean a cast iron pan like that. This pan wow. has no seasoning. I don't have to re-season it. You know what yeah. seasoning means? No. <clears throat> that means you're gonna put a little bit of olive oil on there and you're uh -huh. gonna put it in the oven. So once you go ahead and cook food in there that sticks beyond cleaning, yeah. then you have to go ahead and cook <laughs> your pan. Oh my God. It doesn't even make any sense. No. That's why the non-stick cookware in the early 80s took over. But again, we lost that yes. extra dimension of cooking. Because yes. when you make a steak at home, mm -hmm. it looks right, mm -hmm. but it doesn't taste like you know it should and that's the cast iron cooking. This is the deal. If you, know, I mean, and so many of us, we know the benefits of cast iron cooking. If you are still, or maybe it's your mom or your grandmom, you mm -hmm. remembered her cooking with a, a cast iron skillet and you don't even know how old the skillet was. <laughs> it was old mm. and they were still cooking and it never wore out. We have one out. in our family. Yeah. We've had this pan in our family for almost 200 years. Seriously? There's been fights over this cast iron pan. <laughs> Can I promise you right now on national television, yeah. no one's gonna fight you for your copper pan. <laughs> All right? They're gonna fight you for this. So guys, watch this. Okay. Um, if, if any of you had that grandma that had the cast iron, yeah. The spoon came out when you didn't put fat or oil. The spoon came out when you put anything acidic in it because then grandma had to re-season that thing. Yes. So watch what I'm gonna do here. Here's okay. another great big no-no. Red wine in a cast iron pan, unless you are absolutely prepared to re-season that pan, okay. is a horrible, horrible, horrible idea. Okay. It just is. Because all that acid is gonna do is remove all of the olive oil mm -hmm. that you worked so hard to season that pan with. But please remember, yeah. this is non-stick. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. This is dishwasher safe. You can rinse it out. We took one when we were testing this heavy when we first got it, just so I know yeah. that what I'm telling our customer is exactly what they Look can at expect that. at home. Yeah. We actually, we live in Florida here. We loaded this guy up with water and left it in the Florida heat for two weeks outside. Oh, yeah. Nothing. No. Not even a, these won't rust. Oh, absolutely God. nothing. And here's that cleanup, Tamara. Mm -hmm. I got to tell you. Look this that. will absolutely change the way you cook everything at home to be able to do that. Just wipe clean. That's it. You take it straight out of the box and you keep on using it. Exactly. You don't have to season it. You don't have to prep it. You don't have to, you know, baby it. Um, you don't have to read to it at night. I mean, literally, <laughs> you just use it. You just cook. I love it. Whatever it is you want to cook in it. You fry, you fry your chicken in it. You make your steaks and your burgers. Absolutely. From the most delicate to the heartiest of meals, you're going to do it in your cast iron. And it's a customer pick. So if you want to read the reviews, do it. Now, I will tell you a couple things. Absolutely. It is cast iron, so it's got some weight to it. Well, let's have All a right? look here. Okay. You know, a lot of times people will see cast iron-like pans. Yes. They're enamel coated, they're something coated, they're this coated, that's coated. When you pick up a cast iron pan, you know, know it, it. <laughs> okay? And here's why you know it. Okay. Because these are seven and a half pounds. This isn't tofu cast iron <laughs> to get you there. This is cast iron. So that yeah. experience that you had from grandma's cooking, mm. when you've actually used a well-seasoned pan and you can taste that difference no matter yes. what you put in it. Oh. Yeah. So the construction is important too. I wanna, I wanna show you this, okay? okay. So now. We didn't just do our, uh, you know, proprietary nonstick cast iron on the bottom, mm -hmm. all right? Every square centimeter of this pan is the same material. So whether it's the helper handle, the bottom, uh, the gas, glass, electric, and conductive heat friendly pan, okay. all right, that's important. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, everything is made of the same material. Even the sidewalls that go up a full two and a quarter inches. Now, why does that matter? Because this is that pan when it comes time for that southern fried chicken. Mm -hmm. Guys, you've got everything you need in a 12 inch cast iron pan to create some of the most iconic dishes in the country. And by the way, for the last three weeks, we've been traveling the country mm -hmm. in our RV with our family. They're actually waiting for me in Memphis when I'm done my shows here, I'm gonna join them again. Mm -hmm. But we've been experiencing such incredible food. And I've noticed no matter where we go, yeah. the pride of people that use cast iron on their food, it's on signs. Yes. Now you can do that instead of that cookware, which basically, right. it's like that kid's toy that you turn over and shake and everything disappears. Yeah. It's kind of like cooking with those. Yeah. With these, every time you make a meal, you leave your family signature. And if you've got one of those pans that have been in the family forever, yeah. you know what I'm talking about. You do. And that's that's what it was talk, or called cooking with love, remember? Right. You know, how some family members, whether it's your aunt or your mom or your grandma, they just had, a, there was something about the way they cooked exactly. and you can still taste it even years later. 
That's what cast iron is, and that's the tradition it's, that, that has been built on it. This is everything we love about cast iron, only better because now it's nonstick. Exactly. Because now we don't have to season it. Now we could put it in the dishwasher <laughs> if we wanted to. Oh, please, no, please do. Yes. It's the easiest way. I, I know it. Yeah. You know what? It doesn't feel right to say. I know. Cast I iron, know. You, you, you hear putting it in the dishwasher, you feel this. Right. <laughs> Guys, put it in the dishwasher. Let it soak in the sink. It yeah. really doesn't matter. Yeah. All right? Let me ask you real quick, because yep. remember, you're just choosing your color. We've got teal. This is black. This is mm -hmm. red. And we have a silver. Um, we do have a featured price. Uh, we also have uh, four flex on it, so you're getting it home for just under $10. So when I hear nonstick, yep. um, do I have to, like... No, use a nothing. certain kind of uh, utensil. You know what? I always encourage wood or okay. silicone, but okay. if you want to use metal on this, you go ahead. You can't damage the functionality of the pan. Okay. You can scratch it like any other cast iron, okay. but you can't damage it. The functionality never changes. Use uh, uh, wood and silicone. You never have to worry about it. Now, okay. I want to share one of my favorite, uh, like, uh, big crowd recipes for you, okay? If I've got like six, seven people coming over, I always do this. This is so simple, all right? All you're gonna do is take two cans of your favorite cream or of whatever soup, all right? <laughs> Add in a few extra vegetables. Mm -hmm. There we go, so we can all feel good about ourselves, <laughs> just like that. Okay. Give, give it a bit of a stir. Now, here's what's cool. What I usually do is I go out and I find my favorite fried chicken. I'll pull the meat off and I'll make that part of the pot pie, mm -hmm. okay? And then I'll go ahead and I'll take biscuits. And I'm gonna drop a biscuit for as many guests as I have coming over. Okay. So if you've got four, drop four. If you've got six, drop six. If you've got eight, drop eight. I don't have to keep going. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna do a few there, just like that. But now here's the magic, ready for this? Okay. Save that skin, because you're gonna go ahead ah. and you're gonna tuck a little piece of that unbelievable southern fried chicken mm -hmm. skin right on top. Now, okay. I'm gonna let this be, but I'm gonna go to the oven, because I know we have one finished. Okay. Oh, but in the meantime, let's go ahead and start searing our beautiful Oh, pot roast, I love that. Yeah. All right, so let me grab this guy. Okay. So, like I said, guys, what I love about cookware like this is it makes these neat and interesting dishes not only fun, yeah. but achievable for everybody at home. I've always said, you know, Cooking at home has gotten so much different and better over the years because we have access to the equipment that we've never had before. So yeah, when you can make dishes like not. this oh my gosh. in minutes, holy moly, you guys. It's so simple, so fast, so easy. And I gotta say it again. Yeah. It's, it's nonstick. Non and you can put it in the dishwasher. It's nonstick. You can put it in the dishwasher. You can wipe it clean. Mm -hmm. You don't need to season it. It's all of those things. Because I know some, some of you are just tuning in and you're seeing non you're seeing cast iron and you are flashing back to cast iron of old. Totally. Still, we love to cook with it.